Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back from over to Sky 4, Promise Revisited. In the last episode, uh, we beat up some more soldiers from both Rekidona and Gustark, but the war is showing no signs of stopping. Fortunately for us, uh, Tyrant Valvatores has shown up to, uh, to feast upon the arrogance of humans or whatever. So yeah, he's here and we are not. In order to stop the war, Nagi summoned Fuka and Desko as the ultimate warriors. Together, they crushed many battlefields until the day they came across the ultimate vampire, Tyrant Valatoris. Nagi could only quiver in fear as Fuka and Desko carried her as they ran away. She had only one question, which was... So, that vampire, what do you know about him? His name is Valzi, and in the future, he's a hardcore sardine maniac slash printy instructor. Um... Sorry, I don't understand any of that. What Fixis is saying is, we know a vampire named Mr. Valzi, and that vampire we saw is the Mr. Valzi from the past. Past? Does that mean you two came from the future? Yeah, I guess you could say that. <gasps> Big Sis! Does that mean we won't be able to get back on our own? Oh, crap. You're right. It'll be fine. As soon as the war is over, I'll send you right back. But now I see. That's why you were so happy to see him. If we had known that was Tyrant Balzi, we wouldn't have gone up to him like that. Tesco's never seen Mr. Balzi not respond to sardines before. Does that mean you know what his weakness is? Like, how to drive him away? Hmm. Did he have a weakness? Nope. Oh, figures. But I never thought something like him would show up. Well, there's no point in thinking about it too hard. He might not show up again. But if he does, we'll figure something out. Right, Nags? Yeah. Nags. Huh? Nags? Yeah, your name is Nagi, right? So, Nags. Nags. Why do you need to shorten that? That's a nice name! Desko will call you that too from now on! It's not like we're in a hurry to get back, so we'll help you out. Hopefully, we'll put an end to the war. Oh, um, yeah. Thanks. Episode 2, The Destined Encounter. Vampire hunting? Yeah, the mechanology summoning spells were originally created to fight vampires. Too bad you didn't summon Richter Belmont. They started arriving just before the war began. Their first victim was a young lady. Things only got worse from there. Artina? Vampires turned the rural towns into ghost towns, or so I've heard. The kingdom tried to use soldiers to defeat those demons, but it was no use. That's the whole reason spells to summon ultimate warriors were created. Although, they never worked. Mr. Valsy was attacking humans too? <gasps> Mr. Valsy from the future would never do such a thing! I don't know if it's the same vampire, but either way, the fact that they have so much power hasn't changed. You said earlier that we'll figure something out if he shows up, but to be honest, I'd rather not see him again. You have a point. Tyrant Valsy looked really angry. It's probably best not to agitate him. Disco doesn't want her blood to be sucked. I'm pretty sure he only goes after humans. Me neither. I'm so cute, he'd probably start with me. Don't worry. I've heard that vampires go for virgins first. Dawn! What? I am a virgin! I mean... What's with this siren? Is this some kind of joke? My dad took 
this place seriously, so I doubt anything here is a joke. Are you saying that trap door wasn't a joke? Anyway, what's the siren for? Hold on, let me go check. What? A foreign monster appeared? A monster on Earth? Could it be Mr. Valsy? I don't think so. A according to this, the monster can't talk. What's going on here? Well, it won't do any good to think about it here. We should go find out for ourselves. Desco doesn't know what it's doing here, but she has a bad feeling about this. Okay, let's go. It's near Gustark's eastern border. Heal up, let's grab some treasure chests. Hades Karate. <laughs> sure. I don't even. Snow Fairy Tricks. showed up in this uninhabited area. I was really worried there were going to be casualties. Yeah, we don't really have to worry about casualties in a place like this. <gasps> Big sis! Desco found a monster, and it's attacking someone! Huh? Someone's here? It's Artina! Want some bad puppies. Sister Artina is very high level for a nun. She's got a. Uh, her skills have changed a good bit. Apparently, based on res. That's interesting. No weapon forte. Increase ally stats by 10%, decrease enemy stats by 10%. Huh. Looks like an interesting enough unit. have enough move to uh, negate the, the gimmick of this map entirely. So, uh, whoops! Let's get some guys out here and uh, kick some butt. Neglected to give Lance and an, uh, a weapon. This is the end. One non season. Rutila, you couldn't kill your puppy in one hit. Shame on you.
Thank you very much for helping me. You're very strong for someone so young. I mean, I expected this, but I guess Artina doesn't know who we are. That makes Desco kind of sad. Oh, how do you know my name? Have we met before? Well, we have technically met before, but you couldn't possibly have remembered it yet. So, it's not your fault. Is that so? I'm sorry. I always tried really hard to remember everyone I've met. I'm embarrassed that I don't remember two people as unique as you. Anyway, Artina, what are you doing in such a dangerous place? I heard that just up ahead, a soldier was badly injured after being attacked by a monster, so I came to help him. That sounds like Nemo. But unfortunately, I came across the monster myself on my way to get to him. I was really worried, but you saved me in the nick of time. You were only worried? You could have been monster food! Shouldn't you have been more than worried? Well, I was more worried about the soldier that I came to get. As a matter of fact, I'm more worried about someone losing their life because I was too late to tend to them. Oh, yeah. Wouldn't be able to leech money off of a dead soldier. What?! <laughs> this may sound foolish of me, but I don't ask for any money. I do everything for free. Free? Like for no money? Really? Yes, really. The people of this area are so poor, they're all struggling just to feed themselves. And the soldiers are no exception. They fight so that they can afford to feed themselves. Asking them for money is the same as strangling them to death. I could never do such a thing. Wait, what? Did you hear what Artina just said? Desco wants the Artina we know to hear what this Artina has to say. <laughs> well, the more we hear her talk, the more I think this is 400 years ago. She's such a nice person. She's eventually going to meet Tyree Bowsy! <gasps> that means, according to what we heard from Bowsy, Artina's going to get killed in the war. Buka, let's go. Do you know this nun too? Oh, um, I don't know. Do you know her, Desco? in Desco's memory circuits. Desco doesn't know. Why are you trying to play it off? Anyway, I'm in a hurry, so I'm going to have to excuse myself now. In a hurry? Wait, don't tell me you're going deeper into this monster-infested place. Yes, that's exactly what I intend to do, just as I told you earlier. As a nurse and a nun, it is my duty to save as many soldiers as possible. No! I can't let you go alone! That's right! Desco and Big Sis will protect Miss Artina! I'm grateful, really, but I don't want to cause any more trouble for you. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. We have nags here to cause trouble for us. We're already on board. We can't get off now. <sighs> All aboard the plot train. Railroad to tragedy. Thank you. I was actually pretty nervous. Thank you very much. What are you going to do, Nags? I'm coming with you, of course. I'm curious about where these monsters are coming from. Well, now that that's set up, we're off to Gustar's eastern border. Okay, that was that was fifteen minutes. Is there a skit? Yep. <laughs> Maybe she's a master airbender.
Ah, oh, it's just a bandage, okay. That's gotta hurt. <laughs> so yeah, alright, before I forget, let's uh, put something on Lance, just because we can. Here Lance, have a Lance. Wait, what does Stella have equipped with? Oh, okay. Sell off these extra items we don't need. Yeah. Alright, let's try your test here. Did I miss before? Okay. Oh, hi, Artina. What are you doing here? Alright. So, yeah. In the next episode, we will uh, go with Artina and tend to the wounded soldier who is probably uh, Nemo here in the past. I hope to see you all then. Bye-bye for now.